What is up guys, Sawcasm here and today I have for you guys an MOAV playing some 2v2 face off this time on the map Erosion and I'm using the P90 with the silencer rapid fire combination really good general setup for the majority of the SMGs at least you know at least the ones that don't really burn through ammo that quickly and while the P90 has a pretty high fire rate it also has a pretty good mag size to start off with so the you don't really need extended mag especially in 2v2 where you're not going to be running into as many people at once the rapid fire combination is fine you really don't need extended mags whereas in ground war or sometimes 6v6 you might need extended mags just because you're going to be running into more people at once and you don't want to be constantly reloading and etc and then you know they catch you off guard while you're reloading and overall it's just a bad thing but in 2v2 it's really easy to control the engagements so rapid fire does the job just fine now couple things you want to consider when playing 2v2 especially on this map you definitely want some sort of SMG mainly because the majority of the lines of sight and the encounters that you're going to be running into are close quarters you know there are a few long lines of sight like you see down here this little left hallway this is pretty much the one major long line of sight the rest of them you could pretty much be fine with any SMG and the majority of them you can use you know a bunch of these random structures and brush as cover so that makes it really good and really effective for an SMG strategy now you notice that we kind of wipe the people over there on the other side of the map and then they flip the spawns flip instantly to the other side of the map and I find that that's really what happens quite often on this map basically if you and your team you know your teammate you kill their team on one side of the map say one corner say they're over by right where I am now I kill them both most likely they're gonna be spawning on the opposite corner that's usually what tends to happen so pretty much how this game works you're pretty much gonna be rotating around the map like you're, you're just gonna be making loops around it by you know you kill somebody in one corner and then you run to the other corner you kill them there you run back to the corner you were just in and basically it's like a chain it's a vicious cycle it sounds kinda mean like I don't know. It's, it's not really mean to do that because that's the game. It's not that vicious. Okay, it's just the cycle. It's the cycle of erosion. So you basically gotta loop around the map. You kill the enemy, then you loop back to the other, the opposite corner. Now, of course, your teammate's position can have an effect on this. You know, it's gonna depend depending on where you guys are in comparison to each other, and in comparison, bow. In comparison to the spawn points, <laughs> that was an epic fail. Uh, so yeah, and uh, another thing, I'm using Assassin and my teammate is using Recon. These two perks are incredible for 2v2 Assassin. Not even for the fact that it keeps you off the radar. I mean, that is good, but I really don't run into too many radar UAV spammers on the 2v2 playlist but the fact that it keeps you off the portable radar is huge because the people in 2v2 I found that they really, really love to throw it down and kind of play really defensively with their portable radar thinking they're safe so you can sit in the back and say like a building or a vantage point like straight ahead like that little hut thing and they just like to play defensive and a little bit campy so assassin keeps you off the portable radar which is pretty much the most important thing I would say and my teammates using recon pro so if you have recon pro I definitely suggest slapping it on you see he tagged the enemies and because of this, I was able to know exactly where they were, and, you know, of course he was too, but since he was engaged with the enemy, I was able to come from behind, and I would know exactly where he, where the enemy is, which direction he's facing, and I would be able to take him out, like, literally 99% of the time. I think there was, like, a couple times where, you know, the person would just turn on me out of nowhere, but the majority of the time, if the, if the enemy is tagged by recon, and they're distracted by your teammate, it's, that's a perfect opportunity to kind of just swoop in there, and... Take the kill for yourself. It's your kill. Take it. That's the best advice I can give you. Take kills when they're there. Alright, that was kind of stupid. I'm not going to lie. But, yeah, honestly, I think I'm going to close it to my MOAB. There it is. I get those little bush wookies sitting in the back of the map. And this is where I call it in. Just grab a few kills, whatever. Call it my MOAB. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you hated it, be sure to dislike it, leave some hateful comments, and I'll subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bow!